This is Mary Catherine at Red Robin Farm, and I just wanted to show you my latest gourd. This is a this is probably my smallest gourd. Um, oh, here comes Julia. Hi, Julia. I got That's, some spooky makeup on right now. I don't know who you're talking to. This is going to be a YouTube video because I wanted to show everybody what watercolor paints can happen can do on a gourd. I also have some gold brush gold paint. Um, here's here's my paint set. So I've got lots of colors, nice palette, and then these three here, here, and here on the end also have this metallic, and so I can get that that kind of metallic look there. See those fun little streaks? I've also got them on the bottom. Um, but yeah, the color is all from the palette because when I start out, it looks like that. And when I finish, it looks like that. Um, and I also put two coats of this polyurethane on it. You see, I've got some gloves. I just, I mean, seriously, I'm using an old L.L. Bean catalog on the bottom, and I just put it on with a paper towel. It's because it's better than wasting brushes or anything. So anyway, and then I've got some four, four little holes. Can you see there's a hole there in the top that I've already um, pinned and um, put it through a needle? And I'll put a string on it so it can be hung. Maybe I'll show it to you later. Um, anyway, pretty fun. I'm fixing to put my second coat on. I just wanted to see you to see what could be done at home with gourds without any kind of hefty equipment and that kind of thing. See you later. Bye.